I have a story to tell you. Yes! What's up, Tommy? Hey, Blanche. Yes, come on, come on. Have a seat, come right over here. Perfect, have a seat right there. Excellent, excellent. Ooh, you found a little star. You found another one. Okay, here's my first question for you. What am I holding in my hand? A crayon. A crayon. What color is this crayon? Purple. Excellent. I am going to tell you the story of Purple Purple. Can everyone see? Once upon a time, there was a creature named Purple Purple. Her favorite thing in the world was being purple. Her least favorite thing was being alone. And right now, Purple Purple was all by herself. So she decided to go on a journey to find a place to belong. She found a place filled with other little creatures. They seemed to be nice, but Purple Purple didn't quite fit in with this group. They wanted her to be more like them, which meant being less purple. And being purple is Purple Purple's favorite thing in the world. <laughs> so she kept going on her journey to find a place to belong. The next place she found felt off from the minute she walked in. <laughs> Everything was so black and white. There was a fine line down the middle, and everything fell to one side or to the other. This or that, us or them, good or bad, in or out. There was no color here, not even a shade of gray, or 50 of them. <laughs> Purple Purple knew she couldn't be herself in this place, so she kept going on her journey to find a place to belong. Purple Purple found a new place, and this one looked much better. There was some color. She scampered over to the little green creatures to find out more. We're all going over there, said the green creatures. What's over there, she asked. We're all combining ourselves into a single color. Isn't it great? Do I still get to be purple? Asked Purple Purple. We all give up our color to join this great melting pot. We leave our colors at the door. <laughs> purple Purple never wanted to stop being purple. That's her favorite part about herself. <laughs> but she didn't want to be alone anymore. But being with other people who wouldn't let her be her wasn't worth it. She knew this place wasn't for her. So she kept going on her journey. Purple Purple felt like giving up. Maybe she would be alone forever. Maybe she should go back to that first place and try to be orange. At least orange is a color. It's, it's not purple, but maybe purple purple would get used to it after a while. And what do you think, Tommy? Purple purple could be pink. Purple purple could be pink? <laughs> That's a good idea. Well, well, just when purple purple was about to turn around, she noticed something see it? Out of the corner of her eye. Do you see it? She took a closer look. Purple Purple had never seen so many colors in one place. She didn't know a place like this could even exist. It was so beautiful. Hi, how are you? You look amazing. We're so glad to see you. Everyone here welcomed her in. Purple Purple was nervous. Was this another melting pot? Would they take away her color? Purple Purple loved being purple, and she didn't want to ever give that up. 
What is this place? she asked. This is a rainbow where we need every color. We need every color, said all the other colors to Purple Urple, but we don't have any purple. We've been waiting for you, and we need you to be exactly who you are. You are welcome in this place. <laughs> purple Urple had never been so happy. She could be her purple self and she was surrounded by other amazing colors. Purple Urple finally found a place to belong. The end. Let's all stand up. We're all gonna hold on to this blanket. And repeat after me. Let's say this prayer together. Repeat after me. God, thank you, God, thank you. For, all for all the different colors and for making us exactly who we are and for places where we can be exactly who we are, especially Purple Purple. Amen. Amen. Amen.